Hey guys, it's Jonathan from Bullet Motorsports. Today I'm going to show you one of my favorite cars in our inventory right now. This is a 1969 Camaro powered by a 427, 425 horsepower engine made it to a four speed transmission, 12 volt rear end with 411 gears. This is a Copo recreation. If you guys want to find out more information, definitely click on the link below. We're going to have underside shots the whole nine yards. It's also going to tell you if it's going to auction, so you can click on it, go straight to bring a trailer, which is where we're going to showcase this beautiful piece. Also, please subscribe so we can give you more great content just like this. You're about to see this thing drag race down Ravenswood, baby. We're going to start off with the overall condition. This is easily a 9 out of 10. It's perfect. All the gaps are proper. It does have factory metal on the roof, doors. Uh, I believe the quarters were replaced by GM uh, Goodmark pieces. And all of the lines are perfect. So if you can go on either side of this car and the quarters fit perfect, it's rolling on a set of Goodyear tires. And there's five of them. There's one in the, in the trunk. And this has a total of 69 miles. How fitting, since this is a 1969 on the restoration. It was restored in 2006 and it was done to the T. So what we're going to do is we're going to break down all of the numericals for you from the motor, the transmission, the rear end, the alternator, anything you could think of is going to be broken down in the description to allow you to decipher how nice this car is. Uh, it has all new stainless steel brake and fuel lines, complete wiring harness made by factory fit wiring, new gas tank, the whole nine yards. I mean, we're talking about everything replaced. And obviously you can see Will in the reflection right there. As we go down the driver's side, you're gonna see how beautiful this black paint is. It's extremely rich. I apologize for the dust. All of your badges are proper. And look at those wheels. This thing is just menacing. Roof line's extremely nice, and that is original metal up there. Interior is extremely clean, so you have that white interior. And this also is a radio and heat delete car, so you don't have a radio. This was specifically restored to look like a Copo Camaro. Rear quarters, as I said, were replaced. The rear end is extremely clean. All of the chrome is show quality and it was done by Bright Metals of Bowling Green. All plated parts that you're gonna see in the engine bay and throughout were done by Stephen Gregory of Brake Booster. They're out of California. This car originated in California, so we have the original registration from when it was purchased. And we also have a reproduction uh, window sticker here that breaks down how it was built. We'll showcase that in the gallery. Let me show you guys the good stuff. Pop the hood. So there's your power plant, 427, winter intake. There's your trim tag as well. And we're gonna break down all the new numericals as we stated before. It does have power brakes, so it has disc brakes up front. Alternator is proper, and everything is period correct for 69. Does have the proper radiator as well, with the uh, flared tube right here, which is proper for the 427. And that was actually made for this car. Hood is extremely nice. Paint shows extremely well. I know we walked down the driver's side already, but I want to show you in the trunk. Please be sure to look at the photos of the underneath of this vehicle because you're going to be blown away. Opening up the trunk, you can see that it's perfect. I mean, it's just like you bought this car in 69, probably better. You do have a full size spare that matches the other tires. Trunk liner is extremely clean. You can see that it's all metal. All your taillight bezels look perfect. You have all the proper stickers. This is a beauty. So we're gonna break down exactly what was done in the restoration. Right now, we're gonna jump in it and start it up so you can hear it. We're gonna take it for a ride, and I'm gonna show you what a 427 with 411 gears can really do. Emergency brake is holding it. I'm just putting the key in. I'm not giving it any gas right now. 
I am running 100 oct or 110 right now in here just to, for storage. <laughs> Clutch. 69 miles in the restoration. Tack works, and it starts up like that every single time. Her shifter, comfort steering wheel. Let me get back there so you can hear it. I wish you were here so you could smell it too, because it smells amazing. Let's go for a ride. We're inside right now. I'm going to go over the interior components. So the dash was done by a Vacuum out of Canada, and they did all of the replating, so you can see that it looks like brand new. Fuel gauge works. All your wiper controls that work properly. Uh, all the plating around your Camaro dash right here on top of the glove box. Ashtray is like brand new. And then the only additional gauge would be the water temperature gauge, which is pretty important since there's no other gauges on this dash. You have a tack and a speedometer that goes to 140, so it's a 140 mile an hour speedometer. Her shifter and the interior is perfect. So it has the original doors, roof. So let's go over the metal in this car. So it has the original doors, deck lid, top and floors. It has good mark full quarters, which are great. And then it has GM fenders and hood. So those are not the original fenders for the car or the hood for the car, but they are uh, original components. Emergency brake works. By the way, it's 102 degrees here in Florida. Clutch is really easy. And this car is definitely gonna give me a workout because it does not have power steering. That's not what this is built for. This is built to go straight and fast. It does have uh, power disc brakes and the headliner is extremely nice. Lights illuminate. Before the listing, this was actually sent out to get a complete nut and bolt checkup and service. So all the fluids and filters were replaced and uh, it was tuned by Mike Fig, so Fig Performance. So this thing is gonna run amazing. There's our mascot dog. I don't know, he's been coming around for the past couple of days. What's up, bud? Not interested. Not interested. In... Probably saw himself in the reflection. Yeah. Trans shifts perfect. I'm really excited to get it into an open area. If you guys have any questions about this ride or if you need additional photos, you can give us a call at 954-363-2261. We've sold close to now 1,800 cars, and it's all sight unseen, and we have 100% positive feedback. You can look at our reputation on all of the auction sites, and you'll see that we are telling it exactly as it is. baby drag machine hopefully you can see how much I had to concentrate to keep this bad girl going straight <laughs> with those tires <laughs> power delivery is smooth there's no hesitation on that carburetor and it feels like you're flying I don't know how fast I was going but it felt real good clutch feels really good tracking straight. Um, obviously it has period correct tires on it, so you're going to have that narrow feeling. That's what it's all about. We are in fourth gear right now. We're at 2,500 RPMs at 50 miles an hour. Remember it has four tens. This is built to go straight real quick. Temperature is good too, so we're at 100 and uh, 77 degrees and it's really hot here in Florida steering is nice and tight so it's not floaty it moves where it needs to go we're gonna go get you guys some artistic shots right now so you can see it rolling in slow motion the whole nine yards to help you guys decide we're gonna go over some bumps here so you can see how it feels how the suspension feels how it reacts. yeah how it reacts essentially we're taking a sweeping corner here here come the bumps. Nice and tight, no funny sounds from the suspension. Feels great. Fourth gear. It's a powerhouse. If you guys are looking for a Copo Camaro recreation, this is it. We'll turn left here and test her out. We're 
in second, third, fourth. We're going to bring it to a road where it's closed off and we can actually test out the acceleration. It came down, baby. Hope you guys enjoyed that test drive. If you have any questions, give us a call at 954 363 2261. See you later.